spoilers for why later. It's a tiger. Uh, yeah, so, um, like I was saying about my fucked up old boss. Hey! <laughs> um, let's get rid of these. Getting rid of these. We're taking out these. And we're gonna do this. I'm gonna put this away too. And then we got lots of flame rounds ready for when I need them. So yeah, talking about one of my old bosses, which is probably not professional, but what's she gonna do? Watch my YouTube? <laughs> Hardly. It's been like five years now anyway. Jeez, I've been doing this job for too long. So how much space we got? Three squares should be enough. I'll probably burn through this. This goes into a puzzle soon, so. So yeah, let's finish this story before I panic. Um, yeah, she used to just be completely comatose. Like, you would try and speak to her and she would just make up a story because she seemed to have forgotten where she'd come from. So one moment she was from the UK, the next she was this, and she came from a wealthy family. She seemed to change her name at random as well. She was just <laughs> fucked up as a person. And um, she used to just sing to herself random kids songs would be like <laughs> I'm just gonna make up a dance and she made up a washing machine dance and was really proud of herself and she was just completely gone you know when you meet somebody and you're just like that person's just fried deep fried all of the time and you're like that's your boss man and you're like yeah I'm out one of my bosses the other one was just a raving alcoholic who just allowed this shit to happen. Look, the bad thing's happening. Hello. Bye. Jesus, stay back! He will not stay back. He will clump. Oh, this fuck's gonna ruin my kite plan. Um. Um. Oh, you... Oh, everything's going wrong. Yeah, I might die here because of this shit. <laughs> so I don't even know where I'm going. I'm alive! I live! Huzzah! Oh, fuck me. <laughs> like, how am I so bad? I wanted to go back this way. I forget why I wanted to go back this way, but I want to go back this way. Slam. Come on and slam. And welcome to the jam. Oh, yeah. Two revelatons for this area. He, this is no longer a safe room. He will follow you into here. Also, please, please hold press F for respect. Oh God, no! Marvin. Marvin is the zombie, which you know they did in the other game. And it's nice, it's, you know, it's a nice way to, like, show character development, <laughs> but it's like, oh, why? I'm sad now. <sighs> so I fucked everything up again. Surprise, surprise. I don't have the club key. So you can't get in here. I have the heart key, right? So if you're Leon, you get the club key, it goes in. Um, I got this key, I need to go in here for reasons. Um, it's gonna be one of those. I miss that every time I walk through. I fuck this really hard. So, I need to get up here. We can get up here by going through the library, right? Yes. You can see I missed the blue herb here. But we need to get in the clock tower. But we need to do the puzzle to get here, to get in the clock tower. But I don't have the jack. I forgot that. Oh, I thought that was the Mr. X. It's just Marvin. Hey, Marvin. I don't want to kill him. I feel bad. 
Wait, do we even get the jack? I don't think we even get the jack. How do we get in there? Fuck, the door was locked. Everyone saw that the door was locked, right? I pressed against the door when we were in the zombie jump scare room with the, the clock. I missed that. We were in... My absolute round fuck. Sorry, everyone. You see, it's locked. So we have to get... Where is the jack? Fuck. My brain hurts. Oh, uh, no. Marvin, no. Bad Marvin. Don't make me shoot you. Yeah, I said I had to go back here, right? We talked about me going having to go back through here. Because these are... Why? See, so, I'm not running. I'm not running. Because there was a liquor back there. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Good, you're dumb. Better stay dumb. They're conga lining behind me. I can feel it. But if I run, it will trigger everyone. There we go. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Karen, not now. Can't see the manager. He's not in. Oh, I'm doing this all wrong. Probably shouldn't have gone through here. What am I doing? There's a liquor in here too, so he's right there. They don't know what doors are locked. But losing Mr. X is terrifying, because you lose Mr. X, he's wandering around. Which means you may just bump into him at random. And you'll be like, oh sup friend. And you'll be like, oh. Fuck. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? Box. I missed the box. No, I need the box. Shit. Ass. Okay. This is going poorly already. You can see why it's like, okay, you have to backtrack a lot. Fuck, I heard a Mr. X boot. Shit. I don't like this tension building. Is he there? Don't tell me he's Hey, he's in there. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh. It doesn't get scarier. Where is he? Uh oh. Marvin, you're being a problem. You're a problem, Marvin. Yeah, I should have dealt with Marvin a while ago. Fucking Marvin. Not helping, man. Should be a team player. Poorly. It's going poorly. Well, at least this way I can't dump on my ex-colleagues. Uh, can we go through here? We cannot go through here. I'm gonna go up here. Wait. There is nothing here. Good. Could have been going this could be going better. It's not too bad, it's savable. We haven't died yet, but like fucking hell. Oh. That's no good man. We gotta get that box. The box is important. But we fucked up getting the box as well because I didn't bring the jewel. 
I always do this because I know what I need, I forget. If that makes sense. Like I know and then I hit kick myself like fuck you, why do you forget the thing? You need the thing. Oh you dick shit. Go away. So yeah. They're a thing. The things I missed somehow. This is why you check your map, because if you're blind like me, you miss important things and you can't find them because they're in the different room. You need this. You need this, trust me, you need this. Look. It's a box. Box is important. For boxing. Can you hear the clomps? Oh! God damn it! That couldn't have gone worse if I tried. I open the door and he's literally like right there and I'm like... Is he coming here? Meow, meow, meow. I hate it when he patrols this area because it makes it real fucking hard. He will do something in a minute. Like, bust. Oh, you fuck. Oh, what the shit. You're supposed to take a knee, you bitch. No. Wow, this guy's chonky. Normally you hit him with something like that. Normally when you hit him something like that, he'll stagger and he'll take a knee for a little while. That's all you can do to him. Fuck am I going? Fuck am I going? Fuck am I going? <laughs> um, so we need to get a thing to open this. No, I can't. Oh, I'm drunk. I'm drunk! I'm drunk! I'm drunk! So, yeah. This is important. Look, if you press the button, it's a novelty USB stick. That now when you look at it, it doesn't even look like a star smash. <laughs> it looks really fake. So this is going awful. You can see I'm actually running out of keeling items because of Mr. X and because of my ineptitude. We need to get to the clock tower, but first, that star's badge opens the thing, the USB. That's why it's a USB, and we get this, and then we good. Except he obviously clumpy up there is running around like an ass hat. You can't go back through this way. But if you get the herb. Uh, he is genuinely terrifying. They did a great job with him. We can't go back that way, because you know that pathway is all locked off, so We have to face our fears head on. <sighs> Why the chief's office would be hidden in such a way is beyond me. He's around. But he can't go through the safe room doors. The small safe room doors he can't do. The big main room now he can. So we need to go 
up onto the roof, maybe pick that up, go round down here through the waiting room across into the library, into the lounge. There's liquors here. We can go in here and then we can go get the thing. So you can see I'm going to get lost. He's around. But where is he? Why won't he just stay Oh, now? fuck you! <laughs> Why is he always in the place I need to be? You bish! Yeah, I'll shout abuse at you. That always works. The door will save me. Go downstairs. Bet you he's gone back up, and he? Like, hee hee hee, I'm camping. Yeah, he's not, he's not dolly. <laughs> I need to go through here. <laughs> Doreen. So, um, what was I saying? Yeah, in this industry, you get a lot of drug guys. A lot of drug guys, actually. It's, like, quite scary. But it's, like, you got to see things with a positive light, right? At the end of the day, if you're sober and you can show up to work on time and you can do your job to the bare minimum, in most cases, when you're teaching abroad over here, especially in China, they're like, you know what? He didn't cause any problems. He's got his shit together. Yeah, let's keep him. You're pretty much guaranteed a job. However, you have to deal with people like every single place. I've worked with guys that are like, any, like every drug imaginable. And you're just like, how do you guys get along with it in this country? Isn't it like super bad to be caught with this shit in this country? And it is, it really is. You really don't want to deal with that shit. So there's a guy in here. So we're going to deal with this first because we need our laundry done. And it's one of these. Oh, well, that's not what I meant at all. It's one of these. Yeah, one of these. And that will open for the other key for the uh, room down in the weapon locker room. And, uh, yeah, you can imagine how that's going to go for me. Where's this guy gone? I didn't kill him down here. Oh, I can hear him. Now we plug the thing in the thing. We can unlock the armory door and we can get the gun. I'm going to read this letter because this letter's funny. I forgot it looks like that. So now, yeah, we got this little oozy thingy. This is funny. This is from her brother, who, Chris Redfield. To my bestest buds, how are you doing in that drab old station? Hanging in there against old irons? Me? I just got back from a date with a hot chick. Bet you can guess where, what we got up to under her extra large umbrella. It's, do, does Japanese think Americans think that Europeans have big umbrellas? Europe is amazing. Europe. 
Like, that's so vague. You know, Europe's massive. The Europe is amazing. One month is in no way. No, really. <laughs> like, you could spend months in Italy and, you know, like, just Cyprus, you know. Uh, anyway, um, maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six months. Barry, don't even think of coming in to join me. You'll make all the girls cry. Leave the babes to me. If Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay, Jill. Also, yeah, Chris is all about. This does not sound like Chris. Chris. Chris is all about them babes. Punches them like they're boulders. Don't forget to take this back. Don't forget to do this. It's actually used again as a badge. Um, if we ever go to that point about me dying inside. So, is there anything else I missed? This is blue and it's clean. So, we gotta do the beep boop beep to get, and like I would, I would spare you all this if it wasn't important. But, as you can see, there's a hip pouch in there. Ignore the roll film. Roll film is meaningless if you know what you're doing. So it begins. Now this gives me a lot of chance to talk over stuff. Because this. It begins. It's hard to talk over it though because I'm paying attention to the buttons. That? Fuck me. <laughs> I can work with this. Yeah! I'm king. Watch faster that time. When I'm in the- when I'm in it, I'm in it. But we have to now empty all of this shit into like, oh, I should have put this away. And this is lugging. You see, you can see why I need the hit pouch. Yeah. <laughs> Please, uh... Where is he? 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 Oh, that's no good. That's no good. That's no good. I'll have what he's having. What? <laughs> um, you know when you just make a reference and you're like, the fuck am I talking about? Um, we can take a detour. Probably get Mr. Yeah. Get Mr. X being a fuck boy. No! <laughs> no! Oh, there's liquor in here. This is why you clear things out! Dicks. Dicks on my ass. Ah, oh, that's a blah. Yes. I don't know the. Oh, it's 203. Because I needed both of them. We get a key item, and then we yeet. Now what else did I need? Uh, was there one with a free that I needed? <laughs> Please! I want to live! 106, yeah we don't want that. 103 is a NIF. I like the NIF. I got space for NIF. Oh, what am I doing? Does he come in here? I'm pretty sure he came in here on one of my... Uh, I'm pretty sure he came in here once on my playthrough. Why does everybody hate me? <laughs> Please. <clears throat> you all saw that. You all saw that. You all saw that. <laughs> He's back! <laughs> no! Take a load of burning jizz. No! You bitch! <laughs> the cat 
tacky champion over here. Oh no! Oh no! Oh my god! <laughs> well, that could have gone better. Now, Marvin, we talked about this. No, the hat's back. The hat is the teaser. That's the Mr. X hat. Okay. Oh. <laughs> um. Oh. Oh. That's that's big. Um. Let's have a little peep. We we gotta get to like. We gotta get to like um. We gotta get up to the clock tower still, but honestly, I kind of lost that. Yeah, how the fuck? Wait, that's low. I wanna go. So we gotta get through. But let, I don't. Can we? Where's the jack? Where's the jack? I thought that it were for Leon, the jack's on the table here. Jack's literally on the table here for Leon. It's not for Claire. Have I missed something? Oh no. Oh no. It's not in here, is it? I always thought this was optional and then I always fuck it up with Claire and I think it's in there. Shh. Don't tell me it's in there. How do I even get back? I have to go to like Go through the waiting room. Go through the waiting room. Go through the waiting room. Yeah. Why am I extending the playtime? This is the anti-speed run. This is the slow run. <clears throat> uh, there's a safe here. I always forget how to do it. It's got some sort of gun part. Mr. X is being a bigger problem for me now because I keep fucking everything up and having to backtrack a lot more and I normally limit this to like very little. I've got everything I need to move forward. So uh, I've walked by these bullets three or four times. Let's just go get the bullets. There we go. We got some bullets. We can reload this and then this piece. Yeah, there we go. We've not no more inventory space wasted on that. I'm like clenching. That scared me. The torch scared me. So the way Mr. X works is <clears throat> he is manually following you with his usual striding pace until you outrun him to the point that he cannot catch up. And then I think someone told me the game will, if he gets too far away from you at any point or he gets stuck, he will turn teleport to where you are next. So like if he's like, if I'm here and I lost him like over here and he's still trying to catch up with me, right? And it, they, the game considers it too far away. It will ping him to the next nearest thing, like here. Uh, or wherever he normally spawns. Just to make sure that he's always a constant and ever-looming threat, so you feel like you're never going to get away with, from him. It's a really good tension builder. Normally, for Claire's campaign and for Leon, you can get through this section without encountering him too often. Because, honestly... It's like you're just supposed to go down. Like if you streamline it, it's like you can go down three hallways. But I've done it all wrong, and clever, and it's made it a lot harder because I thought I was like, oh, that's an optional area. I don't have to deal with that. And yeah, it's sometimes better just to check everything because then otherwise you have to go all the way back and you go, oh fuck, I've done everything wrong. And then you have to encounter several zombies multiple times. 